And I needed you to know why I came by. Yeah, I need you to tell us why. People know I don't go everywhere. I'm not interested in talking. Furthermore, I wanted you to know why I stopped by, definitely. I really want you to explain to us why individuals realize I don't go wherever I'm not keen on conversing with individuals, except if it resembles a Larry Ruler or a person of an astonishing kind that I would truly need to go talk. You made a protected spot for reality to be let you know, understand what I mean. Thank you, I for now assuming you will follow through on that cost. There's a cost to be followed through on for significance. There's a cost to be paid for progress. And on the off chance that you're not able to address that cost, you don't merit finding success, you don't. Merit being extraordinary, he now. He said he told me and my person Jordan is around there. He said now, nah, they will come for you. I said can't. Come for me for what I said nothing. Feline Williams has come to Shannon Sharp's guard after sharp face reaction and scratch off sharp eminence for his strong and provocative editorial became entangled in contention because of a progression of remarks and activities that started a virtual entertainment ruckus. The contention revolves around a warm trade during a live transmission where Sharp's comments were considered hostile by many. Bringing about boundless requires his retraction. We should bring a more profound jump into this debate. Yet first remember to like buy in and hit the ringer symbol for the most recent reports on your hash one VIPs when you did that meeting with Feline. I could regard how you do it since Feline said you let them individuals lie in front of you and your reaction was Feline. I couldn't say whether they're lying or not right since I can trust them I'm. I'm letting you know this and I believe that you and I need someone should send it to you and you all been I've been seeing it in the visit you all realize who I'm. Discussing, I don't have the foggiest idea who you're discussing, yet I'm with you. I'm say my name once more, and I'm up with the endlessly. I will deliver the DM virtuoso of Feline Williams is up when you understand he's additionally discussing you, Shannon. It's past the point of no return. I would have rather not gotten with a white lady cause I was terrified she could make them run down the road like Jonathan, come not on the grounds that I could have done without white ladies. I think white ladies are essentially as extraordinary as some other ladies. I didn't realize it planned to cause this sort of wave. Um, I didn't think it was heading to move me in the path. I'm happy it did. Being a superstar frequently brings huge difficulties, which Shannon Sharp is presently encountering firsthand. The business is poisonousness. A reality Feline Williams cautioned around a couple of months prior is turning out to be progressively obvious for him, in spite of the great foothold Shannon's digital recording club Shay has acquired particularly. Following Feline's meeting, his new achievement hasn't been generally embraced in that frame of mind. In a new meeting, Shannon voiced his disappointment over endeavors by various big names to drop his show and subvert his prosperity. These endeavors have raised dangers, and numerous visitors who were once anxious to show up on his show have unexpectedly dropped without clarification. I'm similar to you, suspect, as much he's like sh and he's seen me very much like I'm taking a gander at you, Cam. He resembles Shannon this, will be this will be viral for the entire year I expressed come on man in an astounding move, Feline Williams, took the virtual entertainment to freely uphold Shannon Sharp, known for his set of experiences of dubious explanations and bold parody. Williams guarded Sharps on the right track to offer his viewpoints unafraid of wiping out, and that is oh white resounds. And the explanation I needed to come is on the grounds that you made a protected spot for reality to be let you know understand what I mean. And I have observed these uncultured jokesters come here and discourtesy you in front of you and let you know directly up lies. I'm discussing things that have never been heard in all of Dark Hollywood. He highlighted the significance of free discourse and general public that embraces different perspectives in any event. When they are disliked or disagreeable, Williams contended that dropping sharp over his remarks starts a perilous trend that sabotages transparent talk. His safeguard of Sharp gotten far and wide help from the two, his supporters and Sharp's fans, many recognition Williams for facing drop culture and pushing for valuable exchange as opposed to disruptiveness. His posts were overwhelmed with messages of understanding and fortitude. We were dependably mindful of the business's harmfulness yet. The ongoing circumstance with Shannon is raising higher than ever tales are. Whirling such Shannon's reality could be in danger because of the mounting antagonism. Williams commented item here, and as a fan base, we love the consideration that you spend on the visitor. We love the way much work you've done, how well you know them, how set you up are exactly the same things that we enjoyed about you in football. You welcomed that on over to here in a new meeting. Shannon Sharp examined the disrupting difficulties he's looked since his viral meeting with Feline Williams, recently talking with Cam Newton. He expounded on why superstars feel happy with sharing their accounts on his digital recording. Shannon made sense of that before each interview. He inquires as to whether there are any subjects they like to try not to plan to establish an agreeable climate where they can really communicate their thoughts. He underscored that he has never professed to be a writer and doesn't recognize as one for the people who may not be natural. Shannon Sharp is an exceptionally achieved previous NFL player. 
enlisted to the ACE Football Lobby of Distinction in 2011. After his recognized football vocation, he changed to broadcasting, filling in as an observer on CBS Sports pregame show The NFL Today, which included sections like the Run Halftime Report and the Tram Post Game Show. In 2013, Shannon expanded his arrival by turning into a writer and representative for Wellness RX for Men magazine in any event. Gracing its cover later in 2016, he united with Skip Biss on FS1 Sports Banter show Skip and Shannon Undisputed. Shannon Sharp didn't plunge into podcasting simply to pursue a direction he was at that point deep-rooted in the business close by facilitating Club Shay. He co has another web recording nightcap with resigned NFL player Chad Oino Johnson. Anyway, Club Shay stands apart for its prevalence, driven by a few viral meetings with prominent figures. For example, Phelan Williams and Steve Harvey. Quite the 2021 episode, including Bubba Wallace, got unique acknowledgement from Macintosh Digital Recordings article group featuring its importance. Shannon Sharp's excursion grandstands his flexibility and ability for enthralling his crowd. In spite of industry difficulties and difficulty in 2020 in the midst of the pandemic, Shannon Sharp sent off Club Shea finding another energy for podcasting, subsequent to resigning from Elite Athletics. His objective was to make a stage where dark performers could share their accounts openly liberated from unforgiving judgment. As Shannon puts it, he sees himself as a converse ace as opposed to a columnist. In spite of his broad media experience, Shannon was astonished by the webcast staggering outcome in 2024, a triumph to a great extent credited to Feline Williams. Following an extended period of attempting to book Feline, Shannon at last got his opportunity whenever he met Feline's new director by chance, who worked with the association seven days after the fact. Feline was uncovering industry mysteries on Club Shay. At first, Shannon Sharp didn't anticipate that the episode with Feline Williams should become a web sensation. Up until that point, his most watched YouTube episode had been with Steve Harvey, which gathered around 8 million perspectives anyway. After the meeting with Feline, Shannon's maker expected a significant advancement. Shannon himself figured the episode could have best outperformed the Steve Harvey one arriving at around 10 million perspectives. Amazingly, it far surpassed those assumptions. The Feline Williams episode features Shannon's ability for drawing in with crowds. Even in the midst of industry difficulties and debate, Steve Harvey is my greatest scene. Oh, is my most seen webcast. He's at 8 million. I said, do you think we're going to beat Steve? He's like, no doubt. Definitely, I'm expecting 10 million. That is all cam on the off chance that I get 10 million. I'm similar to that is a very decent meeting. Ponder how what a limited number of individuals that is in the space that interview individuals that don't get 10 million. So, on the off chance that I get 10 million, that is one of the greatest digital broadcasts. Well, that is not Joe Rogan's numbers, but rather that is very, really great for a fan coming in digital recording. Feline Williams stood out as truly newsworthy by blaming Kevin Hart for being an industry plan. He began by testing Kevin's depiction of his East Coast courses, contending that it appeared to be impossible for Kevin to fabricate his profession on the East Coast, and afterward quickly accomplished significant acknowledgement in a computer-aided design, communicated wariness about Kevin quick climb, and a business taking note of how he appeared to show up all of a sudden getting significant jobs and television gigs that regularly require a long time for humorous to land feline, who recommended that Kevin's prosperity was because of sketchy works on suggesting that he was an industry arranged. He additionally blamed Kevin for turning into a watchman working with the ascent of other assumed industry plants. For example, Tiffany Haddish that part Kevin let you know he won't go wear no dress until they offered him the dress and afterward he put it on. And what did he say after he wore it? I went with my own choice. The yet you didn't make it before they brought it up. Did you? It's okay. It's okay. See, Williams' brutal evaluate of Kevin Hart was not really shocking given their well-established fight in a past meeting. Computer-aided design had voiced his dissatisfaction with regards to Kevin's choice to wear a dress on screen, proposing that such disloyalties of straight individuals of color were important for a purposeful plan by industry.